Hi, this is David Treat with ES Property Management. Today I'd like to talk about single family versus multifamily, which is better to invest in in Indianapolis. Actually, neither is better. It's just that each has distinct advantages and there are some issues to consider. With single family, there is a lower entry point. The cost of acquisition obviously is lower for one unit than it would be for many. Therefore, it's easier to test a market and lower your risk management. It's also easier to find distressed opportunities. Distressed opportunities would be properties that may need work to bring them up to maximize their rent or properties that might have been gone through foreclosure or properties that are in the short sell process. With multifamily, risk is concentrated in one area. That being said, rental pricing is somewhat easier to determine because competition tends to be very apples to apples. Apartments tend to be of the same size and you can ascertain amenities very quickly between apartment projects. Whereas with single family properties, each property is very unique. So it takes more effort to figure out how to balance the property's amenities or lack thereof to set the rent. And finally, with multifamily, there are economies of scale that relate to cost. Because there's only one location, vendors can price coming to only one location as opposed to going to many. Likewise, if the property is large enough, it may even call for a full-time on-site maintenance supervisor. These economies of scale then lead to higher returns. So it is possible that multifamily projects can have a higher return than a single family. However, you have to compare that with the cost of entry. That's all for today. If we can help you in any way with single family or multifamily choice, please give us a call. Thank you.